Hello and welcome back to an event. I mean, Crusader Kings 2 with me. Um. Fine. Let's see, is there any money here? There is no money here, there's no money here, there's a little bit of money here. Here, and here, and here. So we'll be raiding here with a bit of peace for far so long. Righteous imprisonment. I changed up the music, by the way, in case you uh, didn't notice it yet, because that other song was, you know, getting on my nerves after listening it for uh, <sighs> nearly two hours straight. Yeah, so. This is a dead um, war band. Let's see, we had to get educate our child. You see, I'm now in a very, very annoying position, I think. Um, I've got a very... I'm surrounded by strong people. I hate that. I wish I would be in this mess so I could be very strong too. Well, Rivendell decided to expand. Um... Wait, what? Territory of non loke An order. My legion was ordered this to happen to hold the title in the territory. Territory of non loke Whatever, mate. It didn't change anything for me, though. I am utterly confused about the situation. So it's a shame that our infantry is such shit. And we immediately run in some other dipshits. Well, that was our event army. I... It's a shame that it's still wilderness. Apparently, orcs. Jesus Christ, they keep trying to change my marshal. Stop doing that! It's really annoying, man. Now, come on, fabricate your goddamn claim, because I'm a little bit stuck here. It's a good child. I think that's the advantage of EU4, that claim fabrication is a lot more consistent and that kind of stuff. It's, it's a lot easier to um, be in a near constant state of war and recovery. Uh, whereas in Crusader Kings 2, occasionally I run in games like this. I've actually had a game where I got stuck between two major empires. And they didn't really care much about me, so they never attacked me. But, you know, I was stuck between two uh, two major empires, which, um, you know, prevented me from doing anything. I became very rich, but even that, uh, you know, it, she became Midas touched very well. So, we can do some political marriages, if we're smart. It changed, it's, um... Why can I not select that province? Who the fuck is your liege? Oh, you! This is amazing. Uh, arrange with with throw her with you and my eldest daughter. There we go. She's in a good spot. Right. I don't think that, um, 
you know, one of your children is the heir with my son? <laughs> yeah, it's an infidel issue. Not the fact that I'm, you know, a freaky fucking orc. But, uh, yeah, it's of course it's because of it's an infidel issue. <laughs> right, um, we're at peace for too long. Oh, I really don't want to do anything about that, but well, you've got to. Go fuck up his lands. I wish that would go a little bit faster. <laughs> ah, great. Oh, I do have prisoners, I thought I had none. Right, so let's uh, be a dick. Oh, I'm just an idiot. Uh, I've culture wilderness as a job, colonize a province. Of the goal. Oh, okay, let's try that one first, because it's clearly broken. And I'm spending a lot more on my military than I'm gaining from it. Isn't that great? Come on, siege through the fucking thing. We actually destroyed the castle. Alright, uh, this might be a bad idea. But I need to lower my maintenance cost by a bit. Still no money. This should be better. We do have a lot more heavy troops than I expected. The culture gives us minus 20. Oh, uh, that is... How they balance it. Oh my shit. Wait, this is... Orcs? Holy crap fucking tastic, what happened? They just took over and... Arrange a marriage between... Can I marry you? No. Take concubine? That's the other way around. Right. That is just... Fabulous. Let's perish the fucking shit out of him. Actually, this is... Oh my god, that is even better. You start fabricating claims over there. Thank you. I want the money first, though. Um, too bad that the changing here does ruin a little bit of the money. Alright. Yeah, um... Let's leave for now. Alright. Alright, so we pause the game. We're gonna declare war. We're gonna attack this dipshit. And then we're gonna raise all our troops. And we're gonna send them right over there. Oh, I 
again exhausted. You are a castrate Gaskell. Is your prisoner? Oh, we got a, a lot. Feed the wargs. He's not a commander. And a courtier. Let's see, Betroth can marry, send it. Alrighty. We have allies. Nice. Um, and we, this is a claim on Mordor we can push. Not really interested in that. I'm, I'm interested in our kicking the shit out of this dipshit. Sure. Having this ally, by the way, ensures that we can have a lot more fun. At least we should be able to have more fun. Um, I think the biggest issue right now is, is that I cannot click on his territory. Look, man, I don't want to talk to you. How you really like me. Good. Now, let's win this war, gain this territory. Let's gain the diligent trade that improves our stats even further. Oh, wait, what? I thought, oh, I didn't get the event kick in proper. Uh, um, offer peace. Yes, enforce the demands. Thank you. You will now be a new part of our glorious empire. Okay, you can all stand down. Yes, and we still need that money. I wish I could raise... Oh, right, I can raise a smaller army right here. Um, but raiding is not really that... Oh, oh, oh! Right, we lose the exhaust trade, good. Um... Employment, ask for a female slave. Uh, Middle Earth decisions. Well, the walks will be happy for me. All right, we have. Oh, great! See, this is an air you want. This guy is—he's still shit in diplomacy, but um, he has good stats. He's a—he's oh, a weak orc. Fucking piss hand. Great weak orc description. He's still a as a brilliant strategist. He is a child of a concubine, though. Right, uh, he needs a wife. Uh, perhaps. If we could talk to this guy easily. Do you have a daughter that's unmarried? Yes. Arrange marriage between her and my son. This would strengthen the marriage ties even further. Uh, yes, we need the fucking money. Every Actually, that is for the my daughter-in-law. I can... And I can scum the money system. Let's see. Declare war. This really does not work. Does it? No, it doesn't. Ugh. Guess we can put that under the uh, major bug option. 
colonize with orcs. Yeah, well, we colonize the shit out of it, I guess. I thought this would set it would quite have 200 gold. All right, it's you did. All right, well, well, whatever. When did you become available again? This should, by the way, really seriously boost our income sooner rather than later. <sighs> yeah. It's five here, five there, make him disappear. Excellent. It's not hard, difficult to I guess to get it let it blah. To get a human to disappear. Oh, you look like You're an orc. You are not a particularly We're gonna And change our marital ties to this guy. All right, are you married? Nope. All right, uh, arrange marriage between my other son. Yes. Okay. Now I want to go back. Back and you. I want to arrange a betrothal between. You and my daughter. This basically ensures that we have a very strong blood bond with these dipshits. And that is, I assume, a good thing. I want to become a craftsman. I hope that my skills are good enough. Alright. I want to learn... ...more. Well, let's improve our diplomacy, I guess. How are, is our money? Oh, we have... We're making quite a bit more money. Let's see... We can be fabricating claims. We need to become more confident that public speakers in the hearts. You're talking to me? <laughs> yes, so we have been talking to you for quite some while now. Well, we can craft an item. Right, we need you to marry somebody. So I think there are three orcish kingdoms that... Um, I can I marry into this guy? Uh, you don't have any daughter. Oh, you have a daughter. She's 11. Arrange marriage between... Uh, nope. Okay. <laughs> I'm just trying, just trying. Isengard. Saruman. Are you married? No. Arrange a marriage between you and... I guess he doesn't want to marry. Troth can marry. Send. So I don't think there's really another kingdom that I can easily marry into, but we will... Uh By the way, nothing will prevent you from making a single piece. So we are actually going to try to craft an item. Or forge a sword. Can this dipshit move already? Yes. Apparently that will take... I don't know why uh, I could not... No, I don't have resources to waste. 
Oh, great, so I... <laughs> that was useless. That was utterly useless. Okay, make him disappear. But before we continue, I want to once again thank you guys for watching. Have a very good day. Bye-bye.